Okay, my little chickies, I am going to do a grocery haul. I've never done this before, but I don't know how important it'll be to you because it's just me and my husband, but maybe if you're a small family or um, there's just one of you or two of you, you might find it important or interesting. Um, I'll work my budget out with you when I get back and you'll see I'm on a tight budget, but I do paleo, so I'm gonna be buying some paleo foods today. I'll be going to the fresh market to get um, some chicken. They have the hormone-free, um, cage-free, beautiful chickens there, and they have their breast and ground beef, which is also uh, paleo ground beef, on sale on Tuesdays. So I always go there and get that. Uh, but first I'm going to Walmart to pick up the other things I'll need. So I just want to warn you, I do paleo, but I am not like, I mean, I buy the best I can afford. I'll just say that. I can't buy the primo paleo foods, but I buy the best I can afford. So here we go. I'll be back with you once I have the haul and show you everything. I am back from the grocery store and I didn't go to the fresh market because I remembered I have some beef in the freezer and we just bought uh, my husband went to Costco, so I put that in here too, so you can see we got a chicken. So let me show you what I got. I make my list on my little Erin Condren rewritable thing, so that's what I make my list on. And this is my grocery for really about a week and a half. Decaf coffee, almonds, liver, that'll make two meals for us. The salmon is wild caught, it'll make two meals for us. Celery, cauliflower, I'll use the cauliflower to make um, mashed faux potatoes and regular cauliflower meal. We have apples, green beans, fresh spinach, a sweet onion, some baby wipes, um, blueberries. Now this part came from Costco, Goolsby sausage, 24 patties, a seasoned delicious chicken from them and that makes about two, serve two meals for us and then two packages of bacon. There's about 100 pieces of bacon there. So that's about $100 worth of food, and that will last us um, about nine days because Larry buys with his own budget, and then I take this out of the grocery budget. At, some of you are new, so you may not know. I'm not home um, every fifth and sixth day. I'm at my parents' house taking care of them, so there are two days out of every six that I'm not home, and so I buy for the time that I'm home and then Larry just uses the staples and buys what he wants with his. So that's what we do and it works out great. So when I make my list, I take into account what we've got. Now I have some paleo chili, um, a beef, what is this? Oh, a shank, beef shank roast. And then Larry buys these little fresh made uh, seafood things for himself when I'm gone. We have a big thing of cauliflower, um, some frozen spinach, etc. Then down here we have eggs and some Ezekiel bread and some more almond milk and things like that. So in the pantry we have canned goods and olive oil and you know all those kinds of things. So we have things that some things aren't paleo but most things are. Ooh, look at these. These are cookies from my friend. She's in her apron, Kimmy Hughes, that she sent me for Christmas. And I've got it down to four. I eat one every day. They're delicious and totally not paleo. Oh, and look at this, y'all. This is from Kimmy. I am so honored to have received one of her wonderful aprons. So, love Kimmy. Y'all go check her out. She's awesome. So, once again, I'm closing, but I wanted to end up because Larry came in and he said, well, that's more than nine days worth of food for the... For the uh, bacon and the sausage. And I said, yeah, I better clarify that. Anyway, so there's plenty here. If we needed to, we could... That's Larry crumbling a bag in the background, sorry. Um, if we could had to, we could live a lot longer than nine days on this, but I average about $13 a day in groceries. And so we do have a little tight budget, but it works great and we eat healthy and enjoy our food, as you can see. Have a great day, bye.